Hello Year 7 and 8 and welcome to this video about the Spirited Arts Competition 2020. First of all, I'd like to talk to you about what the Spirited Arts and Poetry Competition is. This is a yearly competition which gives you a chance to be creative and imaginative in RE and it's open to all pupils aged 4 to 19. Last year there were over 50,000 entries and the 10 best entries from our school will be submitted. If you win the competition you get a certificate, a place in the online web gallery and a £25 voucher but there's only 40 up for grabs. So what do you have to do to enter? Well you have to produce a piece of artwork inspired by one of the topics that we're going to look at later on in this video. Your artwork can be art, painting or drawing, poetry, a dance, music, drama or sculpture. Once you've chosen the kind of art that you want to do, the next thing to look at is the topic that you're going to be inspired by. You have a choice of three topics. So you can either do God's Good Earth, Inspiring and Where is God? The first topic is God's Good Earth. This is talking about things like are we spoiling the earth, climate change and ideas and beliefs about the natural world. You might like to take inspiration from the news which has covered places like Bournemouth where 41 tonnes of rubbish were left after a sunny day. Your pieces of art must be original and created by yourself. You can't copy from other artists. If you choose to do something like a globe in God's hands, you're not going to win. So the next topic is inspiring. And it's talking about what inspires you. A song, a quote, a place, or even another person's life. If you choose to do a person, you could look at somebody from within a faith that's inspirational, like Mother Teresa or Oscar Romero, or you could look at somebody like Rosa Parks or Anne Frank. This topic is very personal to you, so you are going to be picking a place or a person or a quote that has been inspirational in your life. The next topic is where is God, and some people would respond to this by saying that they are searching for God and trying to find God. It is a philosophical question. Some people would look at this from an atheist or an agnostic point of view and say that it's a difficult question when there's pain and suffering in the world. This picture is by Dean Husevin and he says that it's difficult to find God in the world but when people help or are brave that is when God is there. This picture is called Binoculars of Faith and it's by Alma who's 12 and she was saying that you can use the binoculars as a way of locating God and getting rid of your doubts. The last thing that you need to do to take part in this competition is to write a short description of your artwork. So you need to explain what it is you are trying to express. So your description should be no more than 250 words and I've put some sentence starters on this slide to help you with that. This is an opportunity for you to think over your own ideas, beliefs and skills and to use your knowledge of religion and religious belief. I hope this video helps you with your entry to the competition. We are really looking forward to seeing your beautiful pieces of artwork. Thank you for watching, take care and goodbye.